Here's a rough prototype for my intervalometer for my Nikon camera, firing off using infrared. This is an infrared LED. I've got an LCD, several pots, a tangled mess of wires, mainly for the LCD, and a market controller board. It is powered by six AA batteries at, for a total of nine volt. So if we power this thing up, our LCD comes alive, takes about two seconds to boot. Um, I've got a few potentiometers here. This one is for contrast. This one down in here is for brightness of the display. And the most important one here is our delay. And this will go all the way from 0 to 1046. Arbitrary number, I don't think I'll need that much. So let's bring this back down to something usable like five seconds. Now the set mode is the only time you can change the interval, but I can change the mode, or once everything's all set, I'll change the mode, and after a five second countdown, it'll then start firing the infrared LED every five seconds, and it also keeps track of how many times it's fired, so how many pictures you've taken. So we can actually see this in action by taking our the infrared LED, pointing it at my camera right here, and there's one, and there's two, et cetera, et cetera. Another mode, I'll hit the mode button to get back to the set mode. Another mode is timer, and that will allow you to hit it twice. You go to timer mode, set whatever set you know timer you want. It'll fire the LED to open the shutter and then fire it one more time to close the shutter and end the mode. So that's useful for very long exposures, greater, at least on my camera, 30 seconds is the max, and uh, so it allows me to take more than 30 second long exposures. So that's my intervalometer.